What is up guys, this is New Oblivious, and this is part 2 of how to make that thing right there, a leather 2DS holster. So, first thing you're gonna do, is find something to make a button out of. I used a deer antler, because I thought it would look best. Most people would want to use one of these, a little saw thingy, but I decided that I'd be super primitive and use this thing. A handmade saw that really used the same piece that that thing's supposed to use. So, I just sawed a little button off, and it came out looking like this. But after I was done with that, I still needed to make holes. So since I was going primitive, I used this old thing. This is a hand drill. So I put in a little tiny drill bit there and just drilled holes in it. So um, I wanted to drill four holes so that way the button would be held in super good. Came out looking like this. I put one at every corner, making it so it was a horizontal one, and then I had to sand it out. I didn't use any power on this thing, I just sanded it across it. That way it'd come out smooth like that. Okay, so after I was done getting it all smooth, I put it on top of the leather 2DS case, threaded my needle, and got ready to sew it on. Basically, I just did the same thing I did when I was doing the sides, or not the sides, the, uh, the back belt holder things, and it came out looking like this. And I did the same thing I did with the loose ends on that, I just burnt them down. After I was done, it looked like this. You can't see the button, but it's there. Um, then I did the sides just like this, and did it the same way I did the back uh, belt loops. So uh, after I was done with the sides, I used an X-Acto knife, cut a hole over the button so the button would stick through just like that. When I was finished, it looked like this. That's all for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. Please like, share, and subscribe, and leave a comment down below. And, uh, Vikings.